Oh, like that. Starting the video and it's not fully clipped in there. What's up with that? Anyway. Hope everybody had a great Labor Day weekend. That little day off always helps. You got a little extra day to get stuff done. I know it's never enough and we're always back to the grind before you know it. It's never ever enough, like always. But hopefully you enjoyed it. So if you just talk to some friends and some family and spend some time together and had some fun. Like always, you know, it's a time to just enjoy. So hopefully you all did. So before we get into the video, and I put the box that way for some reason. I don't know why, but it looks cool anyway. Before we get into all that, you know, we got over here the thumbs up, like so. You hit that, gets the video some notice through from YouTube there, gets it out to more and more people. If you want to share too, that helps as well. Then over here, you got that subscribe button. You hit that, you hit it again. You're going to get those two bells. You hit that one on top, that one. We'll put it in your news feed, get you more notifications when more videos like this come out. So you know every single time that it is out. And of course, we'll try to put the, uh, I wasn't able to put nothing on uh, Facebook. I had to have other people post it for me, so I didn't want to bother anybody. But um, I wasn't able to post on Facebook. Got into a little Facebook jail there for a little bit. I'm free now, free again, free at last. But um. You know, we had, um, we're doing better now so we can post it. I will try to put the link to the Facebook Transformer page there. Y'all can join that. The videos will be up there as well if you want another source to be able to know when all the videos come out. So that's another way of doing it, and I will try to put that in. But right here we have from the Kingdom, the Netflix Kingdom series right there. It is air razor. Anyway, <laughs> I didn't know that wasn't in the picture. So before we get into transforming her and all, we well, we could have showed you on the book as well. Air razor right there. You know, like always, oh, try to help you guys out. If you lost your booklet to transforming her and you're having a little bit of trouble, I almost said him again. I keep doing that. Um, of course, you can pause on this part of the video. Let's see where you're at and it will show you and the air goes again the financial air always goes on and telling you it's like magic so y'all can pause right there on there take a look at it see where you want to switch it up or anything i always like these backgrounds that they give with these it's pretty cool with all the old ancient little things and then we have air razor in her animal vehicle mode form there then we have her on the side Getting ready to go to war right there. Then we have that cool uh, war for Cybertron. And last week we did the 1980s, so we're doing a newer version. I'm trying to switch up. I don't have like a ton of the 1980s, but we can get some stuff out here and there. And pretty soon my son's going to keep collecting them, so I'm pretty have a lot of... Um, Content for the videos right there. See right there, air razor. Close that box up a little bit. Gotta put it back downstairs later. Put all the other stuff. So in the vehicle mode here, if you wanna make it look like she's fine, we do have the articulating wings. I'm just gonna try to move that out of the way a little bit. You guys you can make it look like she's flying. And of course you have that motion as well. I guess you could take her flying like that and then when she goes in for that suit, put them in. So there you go in bird vehicle mode, I guess you would say. She was pretty cool in the Kingdom series. If you guys didn't see, you should check out the all the Netflix ones were pretty cool, but that one was really nice. So there we go. The legs actually clip in on a little clip right there it fits in right there boom like so you take that out you put them down because this is her feet the same with this one and then you're gonna have to spin that around so you get the uh, piece right there and of course you got to spin the legs around so 
I spun them around before I spun that part around. And you just fold out the little arms right there. The wings go, uh, the feathers on the shoulder. Right there, they go up. I'm pretty sure these will fit in the hand. Yep, they will. If you want to put one of them in the hand, you can as well. You fold the wings in. Fold them back for the time being. And then, of course, you, uh, and the head pops off. We'll just leave that off for a second. But, um, that go down like so. And then you can get a little piece right there that fits in right here, as you can see. So that folds down and stays stuck right there. And now uh, we put the head back on. And of course, with her, the wings come in like that. You put them out like that. I believe that's what they go out like that. Kind of when she's in the robot. Actually, it folds back. It folds back like that. And this little piece like that. So we can go like this. And we got... Right there. So we do have articulation on the arms, the shoulder, pad, wings, feathers, whatever you want to call it. Our articulation right here, this part of the arm actually, it's got kind of like a smooth joint thing that moves in and out. Then you have the joint over here. You get the up and down like so. You have ankles that move, these parts move so, you know, when you're in the bird mode, well, you can put her like that. Like she's in attack mode, like in the picture there. And, of course, that's all her little articulation. I guess you could take these off when you're putting her in bird mode, which would be easier, and or take them off and put them back on in a different spot. I think that would make life a heck of a lot easier. So when you put her back in bird mode, you put out the wings, flip that part up, flip this up, and join it right here, as you can see. So that gets you up here like so, stretches it out so you can, oh, of course, you actually you should do this part first, bend it forward a little bit, turn the head around, and then you can spin so you get the bird head. This part folds down like so. I do like the 1980s better, but you know what? The detail's really cool on these. And spin that around. Fold this one in. And then, you know, spin out. And about like so. Then this one spins around and out like so. Folds down, folds down. There's no place else other than here you can put the actual weapons, which is kind of funky, but all right. Or can you actually put these down like claws? I guess that would be kind of cool too. But... Or hands, I guess. But there you have our buddy air racer. The one that flies around, does the reconnaissance for them as they're rolling around. Or moving around, I guess you should say. So there you have it, everybody, from the Kingdom Netflix series. It's more for Cybertron Trilogy, Air Razor, a modern one, but very cool, very fun. Well, she was in the Beast Wars back in the day as well, I believe, I think, if I remember correctly. Yes, she was.
So thank you so much for watching. I do do so much appreciate it. And I do appreciate it when you do all the stuff we talk about in the beginning. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day. All right. Thank you.